The Shenandoah River in Virginia is one of America's great rivers. Only 150 miles in length and too shallow for commerce, the Shenandoah River flows north and is rich in history. The Shenandoah is a troubled river. Its waters are polluted and its fish are dying in great numbers. Today, the Shenandoah River is considered one of the most endangered rivers in America. What has happened? That's a, one of our little catfish species and called a margin mad tom. That's a large specimen. That as can be. One of those most concerned with what's wrong with the river is Jeff Kelby, the Shenandoah River Keeper. It's my job to keep this in the public eye because the public is fickle. They love to forget things. And they'd love to forget that there's fish dying in the river. And I think if we didn't remind them, they would think it was solved and that the problem had gone away. In recent years, the fish kills in the Shenandoah River have become regular spring occurrences. We didn't come up with a whole lot of, of promising leads in 2004, and then the exact similar type of kill, even more severe probably, uh, occurred on the South Fork Shenandoah in 2005. And if it's not a biological issue, it's a contaminant issue. Something's get entering the water stream, the waste stream, either from pipes or from our land, and that's causing uh, the intersects that we have, and, there, and maybe the, that relates to the fish kills. In the 20th century, there has been significant pollution of the river by industry and manufacturing. The South River and the South Fork of the Shenandoah River are scenic streams, but they are contaminated with mercury. And the mercury contamination stretches 150 miles from Waynesboro to Front Royal and beyond to Harpers Ferry.